Now, BC One, BC's News 24-7. An update on the BCGEU strike. The union says it's standing down on job action at work sites as a sign of good faith. The union and the BC Public Service Agency returned to the bargaining table late last week, and the union says significant progress has been made. The overtime ban has now ended effective immediately, and the union is preparing to stand down on the picket lines at BC Liquor Distribution Branch locations. The blackout on media and member communications will continue. Meetings will also also continue throughout this week as the two sides hope to finalize a tentative agreement. I have to say that frustration wasn't uh, the word that came to my mind when I was uh, briefed this morning on uh, events at the bargaining table. Quite the opposite. Uh, uh, relief, uh, satisfaction that collective bargaining can work. Uh, we need to uh, address and understand the changes in our economy uh, that have happened as a result of COVID, as a result of uh, unprecedented uh, supply chain issues. A new report released today presents evidence that BC's most at-risk old-growth forests are still being destroyed at an alarming rate. The study done by environmental group Stand.Earth and the Union of BC Indian Chiefs used satellite images to show 55,000 hectares of old-growth forests proposed to be included in the areas deferred from logging.